Hello, Lord of the Port here, talking to you, the good people of Ellesmere Port, on YouTube. Oh yes, well, I must say, it's been a rather busy couple of weeks for me, because as you might have read in the Pioneer this week, um, Marks and Spencer are coming to Ellesmere Port. Hooray! Oh yes. And, you know, you've got me to thank for that. I negotiated the deal. Yes. Oh yes. I approached my good friend, Carl Marks, one of the Marks and Spencer brothers. And I said to him, Carl, you need to come to Ellesmere Port. It's great. Oh, the people are lovely. Um, but we need a Marks and Spencer. But he, you know, he didn't want to come to Ellesmere Port. He said that, you know, there's enough supermarkets in Ellesmere Port. You've got Aldi, uh, Asda, Morrison's. Uh, oh, what's that? Oh, yes. And then there's that rather upmarket one called Farm Foods. Oh, yes. You know, Marks and Spencer can't compete with the likes of Farm Food. So I said, well, you know, Ellesmere Port, we, can, we could do with another budget supermarket like Marks and Spencer. Because there are some people in Ellesmere Port who can't afford to shop at the likes of Asda or Aldi. So Marks and Spencer would, be, would might appeal to those kind of people. His eyes lit up when he saw that. Ooh, aren't he thought? I know how to build the biggest supermarket in Ellesmere Port. Oh, yes. <laughs> Yes, it's all down to me. Yeah, they'll have a massive store. So that's what the Lord has been doing this week. Ta-ta for now.